Are we rolling as we are? What's up guys? It's Plum McKinley Crane here today. I'm going to be doing my spoiler free movie review of the Meyerwood story. Uh, I pronounced that wrong. The Meyerwood stories, which was a 2017 Netflix movie. So this movie stars um, Adam Sandler as Danny Meyerwitz and Ben Stiller as Matthew Meyerwitz, who is Danny Meyerwitz's half-brother. This movie was just a, it's a, it's a very interesting, fun, and fun drama. Um, it's a comedy drama. It's it's a dramedy. It's not quite a well. It's not a comedy, but like you know, it's a drama movie with a lot of comedy in it. So this movie is about um. It's about like you know Danny Marwitz going to visit his father, and it's about like you know Matthew Marwitz like reuniting with his father too, and they're having like a little family reunion. And that's a lot of this movie. A lot of this movie is like, you know, their relationship with their father, Harold Meyerowitz, who is a, who's a nice dude in general, but like, you know, can be like, you know, weird and just, can just be, uh, you know, unfair at times and like, you know, ignorant. Yeah, it's about their relationship with their father. Anyway, uh, this was just a really fun movie, and, uh, so, also what happens in it is, uh, so the father, like, you know, basically kind of got, has to spend a lot of time in the hospital, so they have to stay with him, and watch over him, and what makes this movie is the chemistry between um, Danny Meyerowitz, Matthew Meyerowitz, and Gene Meyerowitz. That's what makes this whole movie, like, so great. It's just the chemistry between those three. It's, it's just awesome chemistry. And it's just, I just love the way these characters interact with each other. It's just the, the chemistry between these three characters is what makes this movie so great. Um, anyway, so, this movie is just, it's just awesome. It's not like, you know, perfect, but it, it's great. It's one of my favorite Adam Sandler movies ever. It's not my favorite, but it's, it's up there. It's in my top five. Um, I just really, really, really love this movie. It was a really enjoyable watch. It was better than I thought it was gonna be. I mean, I expected it to be great, but it was a... A little bit better than I than it actually was. This movie is like you know, it's actually kind of not what you would expect. I mean, it's a little bit what you would expect it to be, but like you know, there's some stuff in there that you wouldn't expect to happen and stuff like that. You wouldn't expect a lot of this stuff to happen. And I just really, I just really love this movie. Um, and let me just describe the characters to you. Alright, so, I already just described the dad, but alright, so, Danny is just, you know, kind of like, you know, a minor slash fail, kind of failed musician, um, who loves his dad, uh, but like, you know, kind of gets fed up with him a little bit. And then there's Matt, his little brother, his little half-brother, Matthew, who, um, who, like, you know, he loves his dad, too, but, like, he gets extremely fed up with him, like, you know, and he just, he believes that, like, his father is just, you know, his father's, 
not happy with him. Even though, like... Because, like, you know, Matthew is an accountant. But, like, all, all of his, like, siblings and stuff did, like... And his dad did, like, artistic stuff. Like, his dad is, like, an artist. His brother's, like, a, a musician. Like, I think his wife... It's either his wife or his daughter or both are, like, sculptors. And, uh... Then, like, you know, they're, like, their daughter is, like, going to college to, like, do filmmaking, to make movies. Yeah. She's, like, getting, getting, like, a diploma in filmmaking or whatever. S something like that. Like, a degree in, like, film or something. I, something like that. Um, anyway, so, um... And then there's, there's Jean, who's, I think, the sculptor who, like, you know, just loves her dad. But, like, you know, gets a little bit fed up with him. But, like, you know, is, like, secretly fed up with him a little bit. Like, she tries to hide, she tries to hide it and stuff. Anyway, so those are basically the, the characters, the main characters. And their chemistry is awesome. This movie, this movie is awesome. Like, the story's great. The pacing's not perfect, but it's great. This movie isn't perfect, but it's great. Um, anyway, I'm going to give this movie an 87% out of 100%, which is the equivalent of an A-, like, subscribe, to the notification squad, I will return.